The availability heuristic is a mental shortcut people use when they judge the likelihood of an event based on how easily examples come to mind. Instead of considering all possibilities, people tend to rely on immediate memories or examples that stand out. For instance, if someone recently heard about a plane crash, they might believe flying is more dangerous than it actually is, even though statistics show it is one of the safest modes of transportation. This heuristic is not always accurate because our memories are influenced by vividness, recent experiences, and emotional impact, which can distort our judgment. The availability heuristic works because the human brain prefers efficiency. Instead of analysing every piece of information, it simplifies decision-making by focusing on what is most readily available in memory. This can happen because of recency, where events that happened recently are more likely to influence judgments, or vividness, where striking or dramatic events leave a stronger impression. For example, New stories about rare but dramatic events such as shark attacks make these events seem more common than they are. This heuristic also relies heavily on personal experiences. If someone knows many people who have been in car accidents, they might overestimate the frequency of such accidents, even if the overall statistics show otherwise. Now let's look at some examples. One example of the availability heuristic can be found in people's fear of crime. If a neighbourhood experiences a highly publicised crime, residents might feel unsafe, even if crime rates are low overall. This feeling stems from the ease with which the crime comes to mind. Another example is in health concerns. A person might avoid eating a particular food after hearing about a single case of food poisoning, even if the food is generally safe. Finally, consider natural disasters. After seeing images of a devastating earthquake on the news, people might overestimate the likelihood of earthquakes in their area, even if they live far from fault lines. These examples highlight how the availability heuristic shapes decisions in everyday life. There are several ways to reduce the impact of the availability heuristic on decision-making. One solution is to rely on statistics and data rather than personal impressions or anecdotes. For instance, checking crime rates instead of relying on news stories can provide a more accurate sense of safety. Another solution is to consider a broader range of information. When making judgments, it can help to ask whether other examples, beyond the most memorable ones, support the conclusion. A third solution is to take time to reflect before making a decision. Pausing to evaluate whether an event is truly as common as it feels can prevent snap judgments based on vivid memories. These strategies require effort but can lead to more accurate perceptions. The availability heuristic is not the only mental shortcut people use. Another similar heuristic is the representativeness heuristic. This occurs when people judge the probability of an event based on how similar it seems to a stereotype or prototype. For example, if someone sees a well-dressed person in a suit, they might assume that person is a business professional, even without any supporting evidence. Another related heuristic is the anchoring bias. This happens when people rely too heavily on the first piece of information they encounter, the anchor, when making decisions. For instance, if a person hears that a particular car costs $30,000, they might perceive a similar car priced at $25,000 as a bargain, even if it is still expensive. While these heuristics simplify decision-making, they also introduce the potential for errors much like the availability heuristic.